On the right side is the Jaguar system, which, uh, as you see, is all being uh, fully completed. There's the main controller, which is up here, so that's all wired into uh, into the system. And as there's only one game I'm interested in on the Jaguar, which is Wolfenstein 3D, um, I've uh, relocated the cartridge slot and just uh, connected it in that way. It's quite a lot of wires to this particular one. The reason that the top is off the surface area is that I should probably have to include additional um, step-down regulators, particularly if I put in systems like ColecoVision, so I'll just leave that open for, uh, for a short while. I've been enclosed within the final covering to make it look like a cartridge from the front, as you see, that's very neat. And um, as per usual, just turn the system on and it will go into RGB mode for the game. Yeah, RGB, scan. If I just play it for a few seconds, at least you can see that everything's working great with the master controller. In fact, I've improved the D-pad so that it's uh, very responsive and also quiet. Wolfenstein has been one of my favourite games of all time, really. Played it to death back in the days with uh, with DOS. Not easy to play this one-handed. Wolfenstein is one of the. Excuse me. Yeah. You get the general idea, and of course, as you can see, being RGB, the graphics look very good, very crisp. Of course, it's one of the benefits of this particular system, and that it will allow anything I connect to to work in HDI mode via RGB connections wherever possible. Anyway, this is System 3. There's obviously going to be various other ones coming along as well. And uh, thank you for watching.